Hello and welcome. This get to know me tag was originally created by Amanda Colors. Thank you to Liz at home for tagging me. I shall be coloring in Morgan O'Brien's Autumn Mouse book using Inktense pencils and Neocolor 2 crayons. Where do you live? The United Kingdom, not far from the Watership Down countryside. And where Downton Abbey series was filmed, but I did not get a chance to visit. When did you start coloring? Preschool, I loved getting the magic painting books. The pages were blank, but the water brought the magic when the image appears out of nowhere. In childhood, I would receive at least one art or crafts gift each Christmas. Mum would let us play with poster paints and crayons. Adult coloring started in 2021, when I received my first coloring book, Beatrix Potter, as a birthday gift from Mr. B. Why did you start your YouTube channel? to share a gallery of my monthly finished pages, to show my progression and coloring journey. I also needed a way to remotely communicate with mum by sharing our love of art. More on that later. Other than coloring, what do you like to do in your free time? I have always enjoyed and been fascinated by light, color and photography. I care for wildlife that visit our garden mostly European hedgehogs and squirrels. I enjoy animation movies, gaming, puzzles and jigsaws. What do you do for work? I work in a small international broadcasting company supporting multiple clients in the entertainment industry for TV and films. It is not as glamorous as it sounds, juggling multiple time zones. Other than that, I get to choose when I work.
What are three random facts about you? I went to the same dance school as Elizabeth Hurley. So I knew her before she became famous. I adopt wild animals like sea turtles and currently this cute fox who is being mended. I also rescue ladybirds from spiders' webs and give them drops of water when they have overwintered in my home. My dream job was to be an animator. I cannot draw, but I wanted to be an old school cartoonist coloring backgrounds. I recently re watched Disney's Robin Hood animation, and I still feel the pang of regret. More to be revealed in another hashtag, I was tagged in by Ailey. What is your favorite coloring book right now? Yururi Sketch Mouse Adventures What is your favorite coloring medium right now? Neo Color 2 crayons and pencils. How many coloring books have you completed? 1. I recently finished Friendship by Rachel Mintz. There is a full flip through on my channel. 1980 Do you have any secret skills? In the late 1980s, I completed all the levels on the computer game Pac-Mania. I once knew all the BBC's radio show screenplay words to The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy and the movie Blade Runner. I suppose my current skill is my laser-like focus on subjects that interest me. Learning how to color being one and being totally absorbed in it. Do you collect anything? Other than art supplies and books, yes certain music animated movies, mechanical puzzles, computer games memorabilia from Cyan, who made the adventure games Mist and Riven. It's why I bought the coloring book The Mystical Lands of Kelswich, Along the Arcane Path, by Karen E. Myers. The page I am showing is inspired from the game, which Karen mentioned in a recent live stream interview. What is your greatest accomplishment in life so far? Saving a 100-acre woodland from destruction and having some of it replanted. Receiving my degree in science. I specialized in Aurora, the northern or southern lights. What is your favorite childhood memory? 
Creating Christmas cards with my mum. Anything art and craft related was fun. But her sponge cakes. I miss those and her mother's apple pies. Seeing the sparkling gemstones and crystals in London's Geological Museum. Going to the coast with the warm sun on our backs with a cool sea breeze. Or woodland walks and flying kites. What are you passionate about? Nature, trees, my wild fur babies and other wild animals, science and art, and what has become clear to me? Coloring. What is something that always makes you smile? Cute things. My regular smart female wild squirrel visitor. She is the only one who has connected and communicates with us. The other squirrels are just silly and don't really understand what is going on. Birdsong like blackbirds or European robins. Mr. B's smile. Name three coloring books that are on your wish list. The official Wallace and Gromit coloring book by Ardman. Enchanted Earth by Melpomene Chatsipanagio 2. Alien Worlds by Kirby Rosanes. These books are not out at the time of recording this video, but have been on my wish list for a while. What is your favorite random fact? Hedgehogs have over 5,000 spines. Despite them freezing or curling into a ball, they are fast when they need to run. What coloring book do you wish existed? This is a fun question. There are two mainly to do with childhood or early adult nostalgia. A collection of my favorite cute greeting card characters, for example Gordon Fraser's Country Companions from the 1990s. I believe there was a Forever Friends Bears or Tatty Teddy coloring book once. I would love to see that. There are many books in a children's style I would love to see in more adult coloring form. So a compendium of my favorite cute childhood cartoon, animation, or TV characters from Hanna-Barbera, MGM, or Warner Brothers Looney Tunes. Or one of my favorites from animated movies is, Ariety by Studio Ghibli. Lots of beautiful botanical scenes would be wonderful in a coloring book. Some favorite characters would include, Yogi Bear, Boo Boo, Secret Squirrel, Hong Kong Fooey, Top Cat, Super Ted, Muttley, Captain Caveman, Tom and Jerry, Pink Panther. The Banana Splits, The Flintstones, Roadrunner, Taz. Also the Muppets, Fraggles, maybe in grayscale. But a better Winnie the Pooh, with no wallpaper pages. Or from UK TV, Paddington Bear, Mr. Men, Trapdoor, Willow the Wisp, Rhubarb and Custard, Danger Mouse, or Wind in the Willows. Bagpuss, the clangers, the herbs, the wombles, Mr. Bean for his bear, 
the magic roundabout. Sam and Max. Futurama. The snowman. I am into this wispy textured style. What is a challenge you have faced and overcome? This is difficult to mention, as I do not wish to dwell on such things on my channel, as this is my safe space, my escape from reality, and being mindful, not wanting to trigger others. I do not say this lightly. You may wish to skip this next part. But attending my mum's funeral, when I am housebound, was so challenging last year. What is the strangest food combination you enjoy? In my youth I used to have raspberry jam and cream cheese on toast. If you would like to join in this tag, please do so. Pop over to Amanda Colors channel to watch her video. Thank you for watching and listening. Keep on coloring. This voiceover was brought to you via the PDF read aloud applicon.